Hey there, what's happening? Wanted to share some exciting news with all of you um, about changes going on at WJRR, changes for the better. On Tuesday of this past week, we held our annual station lockup slash tune-up that we do where we get the entire staff together, on-air people, promotions people, salespeople, the management. We get in a single room and kind of analyze and rip apart the radio station from top to bottom and uh, figure out ways that we can better serve you our listeners here in Central Florida, and with iHeartRadio all across the nation. Uh, Last year around this time, the main competitor that we had, WHTQ slash 96 Rock, decided to change formats to News Talk. That left us as the only rock station serving Central Florida. Um, We did not react to those changes. We stayed the course and continued doing what we were doing as if we were in a competitive situation. Uh, In doing that, We've discovered and have decided to make a change that we think will benefit a lot of you. Um, There was a huge pool of music that was left unplayed when 96 Rock went away. Uh, Music from a lot of artists that you couldn't hear on any radio station here in Central Florida. We've decided to expand our playlist (laughs) and expand it greatly to include a lot more artists from a bigger genre and era of rock music. Uh, And we know that we'll never be all things to all people. We'll never please every single one of you 100%. Uh, you got to keep in mind, we're the only rock station. So we're going to do our damnedest, our damnedest, to try to do that. We know we'll we'll never be 100%, but we're going to try. We hope you like the wider variety, the additional artists, in addition to all the great new rock that we will, of course, continue to play for you as Central Florida's best rock, 101.1 WJRR. Hope you like the changes, and we thank you for listening as we get ready to celebrate 20 years of being the rock station here in Central Florida. Have yourselves a great day.